persuading us about the, the seriousness of this meeting.
So that will drive them towards the point of compliance. And in short way, if you are to be able to achieve all this work, you realize that you need to look at the emotional discipline. Simply, how do you manage your feelings? We are in a community like this one. I'm talking about a station covered where right now I have a parent who wrote his daughter. Where last week I took a young man who raped a woman of eight hours? Yes. So we are talking about emotional management. How do you manage your feelings? How do you perceive the people that you interact with? How do you perceive the people that you stay with together? Emotional discipline. Certainly, some of these topics are too big that we cannot comp compress them in the minutes that we are living. But I will be setting out a few concepts here and there that explain our uh, discipline so that by the time we leave this place, uh, those who are not interacted with them or who are interacted with them in uh, accidentally become now intentional. Please, brethren, we are looking at a sinful society. Where at all times we need to keep reminding each other. When you go to Matthew, when brothers, uh, Herod discipline looks at a person in totality that God has given us the body, but if not purely used through either physical through what we feed on, we can end up in a shambles. We are being told that for you to be healthy, you need at least every day to expose yourself to three or thirty minutes of exercise. You need to expose yourself to at least six liters of water. Leave the balance, go and sit for the whole one for the whole day. Without knowing the concepts of physical discipline, you will end up a dead deficit. You will end up a dead person. You will attract, your body will attract a lot of diseases that you shouldn't have attracted in case you have listened and perhaps followed those entertainers. We talk about intellectual discipline. We have accepted that at all times, man is there to learn. At all times, the spokesperson of this region has said that policemen at all times we have been believers. Though, because of some perception, people have been hanging their uniforms, marching the church in the area and other things that they are wrong. No, we are always with you. So intellectually. If it is true that what you take in has a lot to do with what you bring out and perhaps portray in the public and wherever you stay, then we need to keep inviting knowledge. We need to keep informing ourselves so that we live an informed life that is very beneficial to all of us and above all to the social of our society. And that's why when you look at how the government has helped our people, they have gone ahead to look at education being a key and introduced the free education from primary up to university. That is all intended to make sure that our brains are given an opportunity to share from the intellectual world so that we help ourselves as individuals and then the society. The spiritual discipline, this one is already so we are here, legally. And I want to look at the attentiveness that we give to the whole world. Spirit. We need a lot of what? Counseling. And we can get all of this from this spiritual lessons that people give. We can get all this 
from listening to those who are born to read when God gives you an opportunity. Sometimes you feel so stressed. See, praise the Lord, the way my sisters here were telling us, thanking God. And you feel, yes, God has relieved me. We are saying that an officer, a police officer, who is spiritually bankrupt, is not easy to command, and he cannot easily know that the community that he serves are the masters, and they are the reason why he exists. I wouldn't be the TPC if they were not to be for the people of color in this city. I can now call proud to say whatever I want because they have said that this is the district police commander of Kawari district. And every time I go to the church and they will come me, every time I go to a place and they will come me, I feel yes, this is the really blessing that God talked about. Blessing our love for God and others. This is how we can be able to serve. This is how a parent down there will impress upon his son who has joined the police and forgot that he came from the community. This is the time when the officer who is forgetting his roots and perhaps forgetting the constitutional mandate will remember that yes, I am not because of my shop, but because of God's what? Will. So, spiritual discipline. The society expects of police to do. Are you responsive? Are you accountable at all times? Do you account for your actions? Do you know why you do exist? Do you know the overall that the community have over you as the DPC of Kavale? We are talking about social history. Coming in all the way from Kamuli, 640 kilometers plus, and you blending the community, and you feel like, yes, this is my home. After all, even Jesus, when he was approached and they told him, your parents are calling, he said, no, my parents are where? Are here. My family is here. You remember that story? Yes. Which goes back to self-control and the control of our sexual urge. Uh, certainly, this is a congregation of mature people. And you are all aware right now that the national prevalent rate of HIV AIDS is 70 percent. And the prevalent rate of AIDS in the in Mbarara city is 12.8 percent. Yes. What does that mean? It means that at all times we need to keep ourselves alert and make sure that we govern ourselves sexual, manage our emotions, and make sure that for those who are married, remain faithful. For those who are searching, search positively under the guidance and help of the elders, and dwell with things like fornication, dwell with things like you know, I am in a district cover where drug abuse is common. Opium smoking. Went to one street, one street like this, just one corner, and we got over four kilograms of opium. Back at home, I have a cousin who ran mad because of opium, which he likes smoking from school. We keep telling people, it does not need you to deliver to know that my life or character discipline is important because the scientists are telling us that one seed of opium spoils your brain. The effect of that seed alone spends seven years. Seven years disorganizing your
your what? You are pregnant. Then what about this one who is walking every day? Every day. What about you, the believer, who has said that no? Those ones who are seated behind there, smoking, are not believers and don't care. Forgetting that from there, they can affect your children. From there, I told you a story where a young man raped a woman of eight years. Yes, you can be a victim. From there, the person you saw a, a photo of recent where someone was a, killed, a relative of 12 years, started slicing into pieces of meat and put in a saucepan, just here. In a two-hour, in a two-hour. The work of brother what? Abuse. These are social issues that we are living with. That sometimes when we get opportunity to talk to the people, we do not leave them attached. Because we have so many victims, victims of rape, victims of defilement, victims of robbery, victims of anything. So, brethren, I want to talk. Na nemu kwa mwa mjini, mwa mjini chao, mba sako isa nidi ni nidi mtochi, mba sako kukuma kuma kwa hivyo na umu, mwa kurumu kwa matanjira, mwa nyo chando nchukonirumu, kwa hivyo na 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 Amo amo ba pasta mmanya umatukai katero masasi amo kujesa ho yes pasta kujingo amo kujesa ho kutaso ya baile umatukai ya jihad sin that is what we call sin contamination already aka ya contaminate in the sin so opi ya umatukai no mutu zuko ya wa busi. Na nama antu ahapi jangkatan kakwata Eshu shonkorbea masasi Mwuma abuzo mshuri za utu kwa antu wenda Na kwe hiyo Ni mpendela Ni nako basha la ngu Hadi ya chuko Echaba recha akorwa Echoko baza Yeta polisi Wote ni namba ya polisi Yeta chiyama Yeo ni yeo kiyo utakajika ahamu Wachingoro hiji Oli na polisi baka ya bize. Yeye mato ka utaka kwa tao jeneke eiwa shanga. Ninga shi eiwa kutenda kaka tuje na masasi jeneke upanga polisi ya bize ni karono ushuris. Na wengine bize akire.
mushtami mutisa kumara kwechi kumara tai namwe ni cheka ko existence cha cheho no munda ga hai no sije ni cha kuba ni kwachi ni turwali a kwine kwine a noise ni bachinda shari ga ni ni bachimira o mudesbors nka a hada ro irwaliro hariho ekayaba tabakuzire hariho ishomero during the time ni ko mushana noise levels zishemerire kurenga 45 decibels noise meter jina as i'm talking now um, above 45 decibels yes yes noise meter area as i'm talking as i'm talking um, above 45 decibels So during that time you are not supposed to go beyond for the five decibels. During night you are not supposed to go beyond the five decibels. He ne omayo kutoa road maya na wana maya haribu omayo kwa kweza residential. Residential omayo kuri kwa hamama tu. To shame ni ya kure. 55 days goes on mushana on mushana as we were here on question of rome king sakam majira mutwiye ko sa ko existes cha chebeho na bani basa kolechi mubeho we no sit so e chibushe de record mu drawing a program mu drawing a program ma na bani basa bani bahebo Ori wasale kutani kashaha ila zakashi kuisa shamla abantu baza kwa bado muchachi ni basinza mukama ni batendereza mukama awe tibati bara kwere bara tunge chisimudi ko kama abatabe chize mukabaga ndira program ya na kwa kachita baza kumanjisha kwa kwachi ni bari poti then abari kwata ebisida bakata motoka bakata ni kapujenda batera ye chakare twine ortera de omuna komo omucha ezo motoka zaku sikwata nebyo mabyazo tsipaking yes asa
Who is responsible for poverty? Who is responsible for insecurity? Who is, who is responsible for unemployment? The answers are there with you. They need to be brought up now. But I, I can basically say there are three people responsible. For whatever reason, for whatever uh, situation you are undergoing, there are three people responsible for that. Am I right? Who are they? So it's a comment on us at the individual level to identify our problems. It's very good already to identify that. A problem you are facing. As a human being, which problem are you facing? And how are you going to go about it? In many cases, people say, government has not done this. Is it true that it's the government is doing it or it's yours as well? What have you done for yourself? What have you done for your community? Where you stay? Where have you done? What have you done for your family? Because if it's about living and I have food, he has the food, he has the food. Are you going to have food in the area? But because he's, he's having the food, I don't have food, I will go and steal the food. And the crime will come in. What does the region say about stealing? At the end of the day, I'm not looking at my own action or act of stealing, I'm looking at the police. Someone has stolen me a batch of matoke. I nearly see that this person is needed. He wants, he nearly wanted the food and the alcohol, he has tried everywhere. I mean, nothing. A batch of matoke, or even a cluster. But you say, for me, I want him where? In the police. What does the reader say about that? To me, I see by now. Where we can sit together and then agree. As I take him to police, or as you take him to police, he will be happy. How about my family? They will be annoyed. With who? At the end of the day, you leave the, the actor, or the actors, in this case, the thief and the complainant, you all look at the police. The other gentleman lost his cow, and I say, I'm forgiving that person. This one has lost a, a, a piece of money saying, I want him in the court. The other one said, Yeah, for me, I'm forgiving, I'm forgiving you. He stole my cup, I've been covered in you, oh, 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 my energy, I'm forgiving you. But the one who made say, I want him where? It's not going to be a point of difference. You see, police, the other day, uh, James stole a cow, they forgive him. This one stole a, just a piece of lace. Police is going on him. Police, we are, we, we are demanding freedom. You call us. And we go by, by the wish, because they don't say whether you stole a piece of maize or you stole a sack, all the same we stole. I think you had one day to station and one TV station. But today as I talk, we have over 310 radio stations. And another one is here where we're standing. The government has also done a disinformation. So many years ago, but of course not very many, I think Kabale was the head of many regions here, all districts. But today we have the Wanda out of Kabale. We have Rukiga out of Kabale. Eh? You find the disinformation of power. But what are we doing with that power? When I was still young, you would find one RDC, one cow, there was no shame on the But you used to have one RDC in the region, maybe that they can get it now. And now we have a label. This was what? DPCs, OCs. But because today, a child is owned by an individual. Those days, a child would be a child of the village, of the community. This is democracy. You have here a doctor saying you have votes. 
Are you working hard? The answer is yours. The question is yours, and you also answer yourself. A positive person in return in the contribution of the two above. A positive person in return in the contribution of God. Where you are good. <laughs> we have good water, we have infrastructure. God gave you forests, gave you people, and you. Everything God gave you. You have it. Are you tapping it there? Are you tapping it there? The person who is negative will always criticize. What gave, what gave you? This is here also. It brings the coldness all the time. Ah, 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 this is for the also. Yet others are utilizing it for their good. For you, you are seeing the negativity in it. Government has put you to the road. Ah, this government has put you to the road. Ah, I'm going to give you this banana. This is this time. I'm going to give you this time. What do you want? What do you want? So, issues of security also go into that line. The way we have seen above. They go, what God gave you, what the government has done, and what you are supposed to do. Many times you ask, police has not helped us, what have you done to help yourself? Huh? What have you done to help yourself? Gentlemen, help me, stand up. Do you have a home? When you are going to post that invite, you told the group. <laughs> Did you call a police officer and then like that? Ah, to that point, you do what? Did you? Someone drives or rides recklessly, knocks the police. People will be there. What is the police? Someone is standing here, this place is not police. What do you want the police to do? A police officer has been mixed. By the way, that, that, those UP you see, those patrol cars you see, are for only two people, two categories of people, only two. Only one. Others is by cutters. Yes, it's only two. One of them is the police officer. The second person, the second person is the suspect. <laughs> only two are. The police officer are what? So if we do, we do anything for the kids, it's by cutters only. Now, just imagine you have got an accident, and then you put your car on Are you getting better or worse? So for you, you want police. You find someone who got an accident, and people are actually looking for you. You call the police. You call the police. Someone is dying. You call the police. They wait even after two, two hours. They are waiting for what? By the time the, the, the person and the police comes, brother has gone out, and the police will definitely tell that person in the commander. Even the portables, even the small life that is laying, is white. I want to tell you, you learn from me. The responsibility of evacuating victims of accident or what is the responsibility of the mayor. Town councils. Yes. That is the one. Local governments are the ones responsible for such success. But in what way? No. They don't have them. Police will do what? That's why you will be called as well as a snake. Police, you come. There's a snake in my house. Police, you come. Let me tell you, there is no single police officer who has ever been trained in the management of snakes. That's the truth. Come on, let's do it. Huh? Come on, this because I'm going to stop this. I'm just giving you an example of Kamala here. Let me say they are 12 with about four town councils, but with one patrol car. And they want police to be in every particular point you want to be. On what? And trip over nine. Police, there is a problem here, you want them to be there. In just five seconds, as if you made a crime with them. No, I want to tell people, you make a plan with us. That you know what? Tomorrow at 2, I'm going to knock 
Pastor Kiza at Bunyoni Jackson, you will find us there. <laughs> you will do Or we can even ask you before we meet every single point there as a preventive measure. Because as police, we have the powers to arrest someone who has committed an offense, someone whom we think he committed an offense, someone whom, whom we, we suspect he is about to commit an offense. Yes, when I look at you, gentlemen, you are about to commit an offense. I arrest you and I keep you somewhere. Until when